Hello, I am Ram Gopal from presentationprocess.com. In this edition of PowerPoint Diagrams tutorial series, you will learn how to create 3D ring diagram in PowerPoint. 3D ring is a very useful design element for creating a number of business diagrams. One useful diagram you can create using the ring is this one called a circular process with four points. Once you learn how to create this basic ring diagram, you can use this to create variations like the circular process with five points or you can create the ring with a different texture, with different material and lighting. You can have the same ring with different colors, with different points, etc. How do we create this 3D ring from scratch? We will learn how to do that by going to a new slide. We are going to create 3D ring using a simple shape in auto shapes menu under basic shapes and the shape that we are going to use is called as donut shape. I am going to click on this tool while holding the shift button I am going to draw a circle. First off I don't want the width to be this much. I want to reduce the width and it is very easily possible. If I were to push this yellow handle towards the edge, now the width seems more in line with what I want. The next thing is to apply 3D perspective to this donut shape. So for this I right click, go to format shape, go to effects option. First I am going to apply 3D rotation to this. The preset I am going to use for 3D rotation is under perspective and it is called as perspective relaxed. I click on it and you can see how the 3D, the donut which is a 2D shape gets converted into a nice 3D disc or um, a flat ring. Next we need to add some bevel to the top and bottom so that we get the desired effect. Let me go to 3D format. I am going to apply the top bevel to this shape and the bevel I am going to apply is called as circle. As soon as I apply the circular bevel, you can already see the impact of uh, the bevel on the ring. Now I am going to increase the width and as I do that you can see that the top portion looks like it is uh, getting a curvature and I am also going to add the height and as I do that you can see the 3D ring forming. There may not be any specific calculation to tell you how, how much width and height you need to add to get the effect. You create the donut shape, apply the 3D perspective and play with the width and height till the time you are satisfied with the result here. And once you got it here, then you can always adjust the um, size and as you adjust the size, you also need to adjust the width and the height to suit your requirement. The next step is to go to effects option once more, go to shadow and apply outer offset center shadow effect. The shadow effect may not be immediately apparent, so I am going to increase the size of the shadow. You can also use different types of presets like this one and increase the size of the shadow. The right effect happens when you do a lot of experimentation. So now I am happy with this effect. Now all I need to do is to add the balls or the spheres along the circumference to complete the diagram. You can always refer to our other tutorial on how to create 3D spheres in PowerPoint. For now I am going to just pick up one of these spheres, copy it and place it along the rim of the ring here. And as you can observe I have also added a shadow element here to make the sphere land quite beautifully on the ring. You can also 
refer to our another tutorial on how to create shadows for your um, i mean artificially uh, the shadows you can create we have got another tutorial for that one you can refer to that so, and now we can have more of these balls placed here make sure that they are placed at equal distance you can always change the numbers here 4 5 now the last step is to add the relevant text i am going to copy the text from here and i am going to place this once you got the basic diagram ready you can always play with the material option here for this ring i want to remove the outline and if i were to change the color to green you can see the impact on the ring if you want to change the material and lighting you can do so for example i can change instead of the standard warm matte i can go to special effects and go for this one called as dark edge and you can see the sheen on the ring so play with the various options and get the effect you desire now when i finish with the title 3d ring in powerpoint the diagram gets completed so that is how we create 3d ring in powerpoint as you can observe it takes a lot of time and effort to create such diagrams from scratch If you are a busy business presenter you may not have the time to play with the various options to get the kind of effect you want Precisely for that reason for busy business presenters like you we've got PowerPoint CEO packs with ready-made PowerPoint diagrams and graphic templates Let me show you some example templates which shows circular process in powerpoint you will be able to see how the same idea of a circular process can be represented in many different ways this is one example which shows four key aspects and here we have each of the aspects labeled here with the relevant text and let me show you another example here we show circular process where each step is leading to the other and here we are talking about four reinforcing factors let me show you another example where the same diagram is created with three uh steps along the process you can have relevant text written this one has arrows without the balls here and this is another way to show the 3d process flow diagram and each of these steps is labeled in a very different way those are some of the examples you've seen of representing circular process the two ceo packs have more than 1600 fully editable charts and graphics that allow you to express any business concept or idea in a very interesting and visual way just choose the template that matches your thought and replace the sample text with your own text and your business slides get ready in no time Creating professional quality business slides has never been easier. Hope you liked the tutorial on creating 3D ring in PowerPoint. If you want to learn more such tutorials, if you want to watch more videos or if you want to read more articles that improves your presentation skills and PowerPoint skills, you can always visit us at presentationprocess.com. Thanks a lot for watching the video and happy presenting.